Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of The Legend of Grimrock 2. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and look at where we are. We're back here in the Twig Root Tunnels. That's right, I forgot about something over here. And I forgot about the one very important power gem. Because we have, well, we only have one on us right now, but we left two more. Be quick. Okay, how about I not quick? Can I not be? Because I like not being, I like being slow and sluggish. Because that's the way to do life. What do we have over here? An energy potion. Well, we can eat that. And that's our power gem. I suppose, I suppose we're not going to be able to go in there immediately. Oh! What? Ah! Crap! That guy scared the crap out of me! I even clicked the tab! Freak, I realized, because oh, it all came with the realization that the sound I heard was that particular uh, door opening. Not that I'm scared of these guys, because they, they can hurt me. Uh, well, they can hurt me a little bit, but... Uh, yeah, it just came with your... Uh, at the same time as the realization of uh, of basically that door opened <laughs> and uh, I need to go there I thought it was I need to go there because there's a secret there that I opened or something like that but as it turns out it was just a, a dog with a big mouth oh my god that's scare I, I, I'm not a big fan of jump scares to be honest I just it's not something I I, I mean I'm not blaming the game it's just I'm saying telling you that uh, it's not something I that entertains me jump scares because well Every once in a while, it's okay, but this game is, doesn't make it a habit of that, so how do I get in through here? Oh. Hi. New area, it would seem. No, yeah, it is. Okay, awesome. I like new areas. What do we have? Another dog. Another dead dog. Okay, let's look around. For secret path, we got a lever. Opens the door. We have one of these things. Yeah, this is the poor man's place of death from in comparison with the other terrible place of death that we found that was similar to this one. It was full of chests, I think. Was it chests that were after me? It was. Now that I... Th <laughs> it's interesting because I'm drawing on my memory. I know it was full of chests. And I knew it, I, I knew it was full of chests. But n now saying it out loud and just coming to the realization that I fell into a hole that was full of chests that wanted to murder me and ate me alive. <laughs> That's a funny place. That is a funny place. Because at the time I was more... I wasn't I wasn't finding it too funny, to be honest. Uh, not because it wasn't, but because... Uh, yeah. Uh, so let's see. No secret passages in here. That I can see anyway. Bunch of healing items though. So I'm liking that. Liking that very much. Okay. Got another teleport over here. I'm not gonna bother with it because we're not coming back. So, I need to open this. Yeah, sounds simple enough. Uh, what do we have here? We have the end game. That's what we have. Is it the same? Yeah, it is the same. What? There's a poison guy over there. You idiot. There we go. Hello. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's what I have. Well, I have one of those. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. I don't know where that guy came from, though. Did he... Uh, maybe he came all the way around. Yeah, that was an interesting puzzle. I like that. That was a cool puzzle. Like that quite a lot. And there's still a little bit of things over there. Things that we haven't seen, and this means that we can now bring our power gem to... I don't actually know. Well, we're gonna need to check... Oh, yeah, the dog came from over here. Pretty simple. Uh, we have a cudgel, because, of course, very powerful weapon that we should use. Really not. Really shouldn't. Uh, unfortunately, no... Oh! Yeah, I was gonna say, unfortunately, no secret passages on the walls, because those are my favorites! And look at what we found. A rogue vest. And I mean... I've been missing that. <laughs> oh, I've been missing that! But it's still not enough, because I probably have... I probably, it probably requires the rogue shield or something. But is it better? N no, it's not. 
really? That's kind of interesting. But yeah, there we go. Getting, I just, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. 100% are tricky for me. <laughs> and uh, it's good that I got that all by myself and on camera as well. So that was pretty good. Uh, uh, when I mean, when I say, when I say got that, it, I, I got this bit. I remembered that this was, well, I noticed, I should say, that this is uh, where I should be going. Okay, so going back, I'm going to need to go to the hub. Uh, I could save. Yeah, let's go with the save. Uh, I need to go to the hub. And, uh, I think I need to go to the hub. I'm just trying to figure out... How do I get through? What? How do I get past this? Well, I don't need to fall. But the problem is, this thing down here doesn't actually teleport me to the right place. What? Oh, there's an exit over there. Oh, okay. That was a little bit scary for a moment. I was like, how did I get out of here before? But no, we, we it's all fine. It's all fine because we need to go through here. Visiting all levels. Oh, yeah, visiting all levels. I remember this one. I remember this place. And here we are. Yeah. Is that the entrance? No, that's the exit. Yeah, because we came through here. Uh, okay, so how do I get... Oh, I know how I get. Of course I do. Duh. How I get to the place where I have the rest of the gems, the power gems. I need to use that cheaty spell that I knew. And without actually thinking on camera or anything. Okay, that wasn't an enemy or anything. That's fine. Even though they might respawn. The castle without a dragon in it. Uh, okay, let's go through here. Because this is now open. So I don't have much to fear. Right there. Yeah, fantastic. This, of course, is where some things do respawn, but I think I don't think I think they are scripted to respawn. So yeah, that's the spell I need to use. I wonder if you you can use him with with that. Let's see. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's do this thing. Save the game. And yeah, the last area, if I remember correctly, the last area is also full of treasure and puzzles. There it is. The essence of balance. What do I do with it? Do I put it over there? Do I consume it? What? Do I use this thing again? Okay, let's read this. And do forth four power gems to fuse them into the essence of element. Not all of the gems lay under the sky. Okay, that's that's what we learned. Okay, and you, that kind of, anyway. You are well on your way to ascension. With it comes a great price. You still have the choice to turn back. This is the Shrine of Balance. Balance is the invisible force that binds everything together. Without it, the universe could not exist. Is it the hub? Do I need to go to the hub? Because we read about the balance thing. Okay, that, that, that one I don't need. We read about the balance thing, and it said the the balance will open a door. <gasps> yeah, it's open. Automatically. That is not intuitive. <laughs> that, 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 but I, I got it, though. I got it. Yeah, but we read that one, though. I just was forgetting. Okay, and this is the hardest battle in the game. Well, not right away. We have a lot of puzzles before that. Which is awesome. And there it is. Okay, what do we have? No secret passages? Seeing a lot of this mossy tile set here. Great, I like it. I like it a lot. Of course, being a vast majority of the first game being this one. They, they put a lot of love into the design and all that. Lair of the Trickster. Oh no, wait, wait. Wait a minute. I said it wasn't right now. I said it, there were puzzles. But I might have been wrong. It 
see what happens here. Okay, it's timed. I can handle that. Got the locks. There's nothing down there. Of course, we know who the trickster is, and we know what it means for this to be his lair. I don't like that, the implications of those faces, though. <laughs> uh, and I also am remembering how this fight goes and why it's the hardest one. There it is. There it is. Okay, let's do this thing, guys and girls. Let's, let's, let's do this. It's gonna be awesome. And I'm gonna die, most likely. But it's gonna be fine. I promise you. Well, it, it is. Because, you know, it's just a video game. <laughs> but apart from that, I don't really know. Uh, okay, so I have bombs over here, but not too many. Let's get those. You can carry that, that's great. Because he's gonna, well, it's gonna be, I'm gonna need this quite a lot. So, save the game again. Uh, and uh, this is gonna be frantic. Let's do it. Maybe that's not working? Oh, yeah, it is. Hold the backstabs. Oh, boy. Is that how it is? What? What? Why do you do that? The soundtrack, I'm, I'm digging the soundtrack, but what was that all about? How did I manage to avoid that as well, by the way? Can do that, and that helps a lot. Are you kidding me? This is easy! Oh, come on. Although, yeah, yeah, I'm taking quite a lot of damage. Should have more protections and stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's why. That's why. What the... Resurrections! Why don't you have the potions of resurrections? Where is my potions of resurrections? There they are. Is he alone? She needs food. I think. No, she's got the potions. Okay. Okay. How does that work? What? Okay, I'm gonna save here. What? Okay. Does that work? More importantly, is he alone? Because I, I, I saw more of them. But it's not taking damage. How do I do that? How do I damage him? Because he's, that's not him. Or something. I... <coughs> I have no idea. Uh... Oh, the soundtrack is so cool. The soundtrack is so cool. Okay. Okay. It's... It's... Oh, I'm doing damage now. Okay, so he goes into a block mode. Or something. Oh boy! Okay, he's blocked. Or blocking. I just need to take care of the health of the backliners here. 
I think I yeah, I think I need to break a break his shield. Yep. Whoa. Yeah, take care of the life of the backliners. It tell it fragmented again. This is way too exposed for me. <laughs> Managed it. Oh, that was bad. I'm not really sure what I'm doing here, but I'm safe now. Okay. Okay. Hi! can do this, but it's kind of a waste. Did I kill him? I did. That was useless. She's gonna die. He died. And of course I missed his death. But he left something. Crap. What a terrible battle. The master key. The wizard's verge or virge. This staff, which has been passed down between generations of island masters is one of the most powerful artifacts known to mankind the air itself radiates brightly around the staff as raw magical power flows out from the crystal i think or crystal i, 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 I miss always mispronounce that uh i think it's better than that that one is it yeah i'm kind of speechless right now that's a tough fight. Because you always. It's. And we got a testament. Island Master's Testament. Eons ago, when the world was still new, but intelligence had born, the ancestors' spirits determined their work in this world was done. Before leaving this world, they gave the words of creation to the people and among them to the first guardian of Nexus. For the entire history of the world, the word have been kept in several secret places, always guarded by an interrupted chain of guardians. When the previous guardian got weak and tired, a new one stepped up. But how to choose a strong and wise successor for this monumental task? Five thousand years ago, my predecessors found the Isle of Nex and determined it to be the safest place on Earth to keep the words of creation. A series of trials were invented to test the physical and mental abilities of randomly chosen individuals. Since then, countless men and women have been tested by the trials of the island, and now my time has come to step aside. I congratulate you for passing the final test. You are now ready to enter the Nexus. Yonander of Malanyera, Island Master, 1325-1487. Right, 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 guys, right? Well, one thing the Master Key does, and I remember that easily, is it opens every single lock in this game. Every single lock. So if you missed something, if you don't have, if there's a place we haven't been to, which there isn't, uh, you can do that. I, I wonder if we can actually open the golden places. No, we actually have a few, a few golden keys, but there we go. We have the Master Key. Which... I don't really... Um... Where would I... Oh, okay, okay! Uh, there was a portal! You guys remember? There's... Do you remember this? Um... I, I didn't touch on it. I barely looked at it, but you might remember. If you know the game, of course, you'd know what I'm talking about. But, um... There's a portal. There's a special portal. I want to show you both endings. 
I'm gonna go I'm gonna go to this one and I'm gonna show you both endings. Uh, so over through here We need to go upstairs for some reason these things don't activate. I wonder if they don't activate now Don't reactivate. I mean because I killed the boss or what happened But up here and it's now daytime, which is great up here. There is that portal over there. Oh, no We can do it Oh Yeah, this portal we could step through it and end the game like that um Unfortunately, I don't have a sa well. I do no. I don't have a save for this one. I have a save before the battle. I have a save over there before the battle, but I don't have a save after, so I can't show it to you. But if if you're interested, you can always look it up on YouTube. It's fine. This is a let's play. It's it's, it's not. I mean, even though it is supposed to be completionist, and, well, I'm trying to anyway uh, to complete everything. Oh look at that! It got it came back up. Uh, let's see if what. Yeah, I wonder how that works. I even wonder if we're gonna have an enemy to use that on, but I don't think so. Uh, maybe we could, or I don't know. Uh, anyway, over there, there is a portal. Let's read this again and see if it... I would have never expected you to get this far. Very well, it is my duty to welcome my guests and my, uh, to my humble abode. And this is, of course, the, uh, the humble... Uh, the island master. Meet me at the top of the castle. And he wanted to kill me. But the trickster was the real master. Right? And this is, this is, this is the portal that I was talking about. It looks out of place. That's, that's always something that really bothered me. But even the top one looks out of place, so I suppose it might be just, it might not mean anything. But this is the end of the game, ladies and gentlemen. This has been Legend of Grimrock 2. Did you see? Did you see what that was? That was the first game. In loving memory of a life so bravely lived, Henry Hackinen, 1981 to 2012. Yep, and that was Legend of Grimrock 2. Oh my God, I, I did, I, I had forgotten the ending. I had forgotten that that thing showed over there, and. Uh, I just oh boy. Anyway, the fantastic, a fantastic game. Uh, yeah, that 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 thing at the end, that book, uh, I think is a hint at the cube at the end of the first game. Uh, no spoiler. Well, kind of a little bit, but yeah. Well, it's the second game, so um, I, I think I might have said that the cube at the end of the first game. I think I might have said that is in the, in this let's play, but uh, I think that that's the hint of the, to the true nature of that, but or or something. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure, but I think it also could explain. It's just a means of explaining the fact that it, that prison exists, uh, and it's just a place that the master or the masters built or something like that. But there we go. That also explains a lot of the stuff that you know people coming to the island and uh, worshiping the master for some reason and all that sort of stuff, and that sh shines a different light on that. Um, and also, I would like to point out that the other ending is just us going away on a blimp. Basically, it's just that. Um, so, yeah, that's gonna be that for our, this Let's Play. It's been a very enjoyable journey, and of course, you guys made it all the more enjoyable with you 
by my side. The first time I played the... Well, the first time I played a game in this series here on the channel, I, I think it was the, the, the second Let's Play that I ever did. I started with Neo Scavenger and then I did with... Uh, I went ahead with uh, Legend of Grimrock 1. Uh, and of course, there were not uh, nearly as many people as there are now watching and commenting. And actually, that series kind of tanked a bunch, even though it was a brand new channel. But I could still see that, you know, that I wasn't getting any views on some episodes. So I still persevered because I I was I enjoyed both these games immensely. Uh, but you guys definitely, I, I I have to thank you. I thank you every episode at the end and sometimes <laughs> halfway through. Um, but I I really have to thank you for watching, for sticking with me through the end, and for being here. You guys have made. The, you guys are making my life, to be honest. The last couple of years have been phenomenal. And uh, thank you very much. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it uh, as much as I did, if not more, or at least at least a little bit, hopefully. Uh, and uh, if you are uh, interested in seeing more, of course, uh, if you're watching this not on the day of release, I have a bunch of other Let's Plays that you can check out. And if you are on the, watching on the day of release, and you, I have a bunch of other Let's Plays that you can check out as well. Uh, but tomorrow on in a few, or in a few days, a new Let's Play is going to come out uh, to take this one's place, and it's going to be a puzzle game as well. Uh, also, hey guy, how's it going? Thank you very much. <laughs> Um, and I didn't know that. Um, and uh, yeah, also, if uh, if you want to be on the lookout for a stream coming up uh, of uh, a total conversion of this game, a mod, or a couple, I don't know, I still need to look for them. Uh, some of you guys have been very kind to point out a couple uh, that uh, I should check out, and I will, and I'll do it on stream. And I will, of course, upload the streams here to YouTube, so you can uh, check out that as well if you go to my playlist page and all that sort of stuff. If you're interested, of course. Uh, otherwise, that's gonna be that. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Legend of Grimrock 2. Again, I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching again, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>